find water on the AT, what you're going to do is you're going to follow the blue blazes that lead off the trail. Those uh, mean that there's going to be water that's drinkable. You still need to filter it, but most of the time it's going to be a pretty clear spring. So that's where we are right now. So we got a filter pump, and we're just going to pump water into all of our bottles to fill them up, and it only takes about five minutes to filter like four quarts of water. So this pump works really, really well, and it gets your water nice and clean. All right, so this filter pump has one end right there that's a wire mesh connected to a tube, and that goes in the water to filter out all the leaves. And then that tube runs into this pump that you pump like that, and comes out the other tube into your bottle. So I'm going to get the camera set up kind of more at a distance, so y'all can just see how this works. All right, so all we're going to do is he's going to put that end of the tube in the water. And we'll run a few pumps just to kind of flush out the line, get any air out. And now that it's running clear, just going to put that over the bottle and pump it full. Alright, so you can see just a few minutes or a few seconds, we got a full liter bottle of clean drinking water. So it doesn't take long at all to get done. And the pump that we're using for this is a catadin or catadine. I'm really not sure how you pronounce it, but something like that. <laughs> huh? This catadine pump is $65 and it's really lightweight and compact. It weighs less than a pound and you can see how efficient this is at getting clean drinking water from even a source that's only an inch deep. 